guys, it's Nina with another video. This is going to be my second video. Um, let me share my screen. I wanted to talk about a second. Uh, I want to talk about the second, my second idea about what's happening in the high desert. It's um, the Las Vegas and LA high speed rail plan. It has been delayed until 2022. I think we've been hearing all these delays for a while now. Um, it has a, it's gonna be a high, a planned high speed rail from Las Vegas to Victorville. But this is what I found just recently. If I go into this rental Cucamonga link, it actually talks that there's a private company uh, that is trying to link the rental Cucamonga uh, to the high speed train to Vegas, which is quite interesting to me. Uh, it says a private company proposing to build a high-speed train from Victorville to Las Vegas has taken a step towards adding an extension along the Cajon Pass to Rancho Cucamonga. Right Line West has signed agreements with key state transportation agencies that lay the framework for connecting Las Vegas bound train to the new design station to be built in Rancho Cucamonga that connects the existing metro link service between San Bernardino and Los Angeles. Um, that's what the company announces. But look at how pretty this like little station looks like. Uh, we're planning for 170 miles train to Las to Vegas well on the way. The company on Thursday, October 21st signed agreement with California State in uh, Transportation Agency, the California Department of Transportation and California's High Speed Rail Authority for the Rancho Cucamonga Spur. But it makes perfect sense because it even mentioned that um, it's going to be right there by the Metrolink and also uh, something about being next to um, the, the, the airport. So Bright, uh, Bright Line predicts the high speed train service from Las Vegas to Rancho Cucamonga will take two hours. Oh, oh take two hours. That's weird. About half the dri driving time, the trip between Los Angeles and Las Vegas, using Metrolink and a new high speed train through the high desert will take about three hours one way. But I see, but my husband drives like that fast. We've been getting like an hour or two. Okay. Um, with Pat, so this will with the passenger at a speed of 180. Yeah, I feel like sometimes I'm I'm driving with my at 180 miles per hour. Uh, anyways, okay. So yeah, so I thought I shared that with you guys. I'm really excited about these new things. I will definitely keep an eye on this Metrolink uh, high speed bullet. I wish I had a map uh, to show you what it's gonna look like. Is there a map somewhere in here? So I don't know if you guys know where Rancho Cucamonga is in California. So it's gonna be Rancho Cucamonga through Victorville to Vegas. So, all right. I just thought I'd give you more information about new things that are happening in the high desert. Um, have a great day. And if you want more information, feel free to text me or call me 760-559-3332, 760-559-3332. Thanks, bye. Have a great day.